Hey guys, um, second video in the fiction corner, and if you haven't read the title yet, which would be weird because you clicked on it, um, it's a book haul! Um, I got a quite a few books, um, I talked about it in I think the last video, and or another video I oh, made, so, um, let's get started. Um, ooh, what is this hair doing? I'm gonna start with the book that I'm currently reading out of all of them right now. It's by Jennifer Mitchell Hart, who is the author of a book called What is this hair doing? Who is an author of a book called Doubt. It's a, another book I am very interested in reading. Um, this book is called Stay A History of Suicide and the Philosophy is Against It. Um, I'm not too far into it, but um, what I've read so far is actually really good. And I plan on writing a five-page review um, for one of my classes on this, so I will definitely tell you how this goes, because um, I'd like to get you guys' opinion on my review first, so. <laughs> it's, it's really good so far, what I've read. Um, next book I got is my national bestseller, Aaron James, um, <laughs> Assholes Theory. It's supposed to like, go over, like, different types of assholes and like pe why people are assholes. Um, I've heard that it's a comedy, but people are mad that it's not like so comedic. So, what does it mean for someone to be an asshole? So, um, looking forward to read this. The next book is by Jean Le Paul, Being and Nothingness, a principal text of modern existentialism. So. My sister said really good things about this book, so, um, it is quite a long book. So let's see. It's 807 pages, um, so. Um, no, but I'm, I'm really, I'm excited to read this. Um, I don't know when I'll get around to reading it, though, so. That is the question, so I'm gonna try to read this and I'll tell you about it, I guess. Um, I ordered a new manga, or manga, however you pronounce it, um, Bloodland. Um, there's an anime to go along with this. It's uh, about like eight or seven episodes long. Um, it, from what I've read of the book, it kind of goes along with the first few books. Um, so it's Yuki Kodama. So um, the art in it is actually very awesome. It's very dark, as you can tell by the cover. Very sharp, edgy kind of stuff, which I'm a fan of, to be honest. Um, so I've, I've heard good and bad things about this, like everything that I read, so giving it a go. Um, what I've read so far of it is actually really good. I really like the art style, but I um, got the second volume as well, so just progressively read. Um, next book I got is The Dark, which is the second book in the Guardians of Time. The first one is The Named, which is right there. Um, I read the first book, like, um, probably about two years ago. Um, could never find the first book again, could never find the second or third book. Um, the third book is in the mail currently coming here. It's called The Keyed. Really love the artwork of these books. Um, so I'm really excited to reread these and get past the first book, continue the story. Um, the next books I got is, I got the first four books in the, I don't Vampire Journals by Morgan Rice. Um, I've heard very mixed things. Um, some things say that she spelled some things wrong and needs a better editor, but I found out that in some books, um, authors use different spellings of words from different cultures, so, um, I don't know, I thought I'd give it a try. I got the first four books, so it's Turned, Loved, Betrayed, and Destined how none of the words ever are capitalized. That's a little bugging. Um, so. Cover's not a big fan of, to be honest. Um, next book I got is Winged. It is the first book in a, another book in a series. I have the second book. Never read it because I'm purely against that stuff. So I got the first book so I can read the second book. Um, I do believe it's about fairies from what I snipped of the second book. You know, love triangles and whatnot. Oh, the teen stuff, so. Very interested in reading what that's about. 
The next book I got is, I almost hit myself in the face, Evermore, by, um, that was Neil, I'll see you. I got Blue Moon, which is the second book in the series as well. I have the third, fourth, and fifth book up in my shelf, but, um, I read these on, er, listened to these on audiobooks, so I thought I'd get the books finally so I could complete my set. That, and I just kind of want to read, read the series because I've been hearing a lot of new things, so like these books a lot. The next book I got is Evermore, which is the last book in the Maximum Ride series. Never got around to buying this book because I never wanted the story to end. Had a lot of mixed feelings and didn't really n want to know how this ended, so I put it off until now. I got the book, so hopefully I read it and tie up some loose things that I have mixed feelings about in this book series, so. Yep. Last book I got. City of Heavenly Fi Father? City of Heavenly Fire. Um, by Cassandra Clare. Finally finished the City of Lost Souls, and um, I'm looking forward to reading this book, and let's see how it turns out for our little lovebirds. Um, so, yeah, looking forward to see the, uh, read this, and I've heard very good things, so I'm excited. It's a really big book, it's like the size of my four fingers, but definitely will keep me entertained for a while, so. Um, if any of these books you've read and have feelings about, let me know down below. If you want any of these, or want to read any of these books as well, let me down, let me know. Um... Or a complete. Um, so if there's a video that you want me to make about any of these books and or any books you think I would like, um, let me know. Hit me up. Don't actually hit me though. So I um, made a video um, that is very emotional for me to um, do. I'll link it somewhere on the screen and down below in the drop bar, or down bar, whatever the heck, the thing, the bar down there, so, hope you guys enjoyed this video of Fiction Corner, episode 2, um, and, see you guys in any other video I make, see you guys next week, bye!